Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to draw a really cute chibi peacock that's been inspired by the little pet shop. I'm beginning by drawing a dome shape for the head. So you can draw a shape that looks something like a little gumdrop and then at the top draw three little curved lines for feathers. I'm going to erase some of the edges of the lines here. Now that we have the face of the peacock done, I'm going to go ahead and draw the body. And it's kind of an oval shape, so it's a downward curving line on one side, and then the same thing on the other side. And those lines are connected by a rounded line at the bottom. The next thing I'll do is add a couple little wings on this peacock. So just draw a line that angles up and one at the bottom that curves. And we'll do the same thing over here, an angling line up and then a couple curved lines down to connect right onto the peacock's body. Now that I have the wings, the head, and the body finished, I'll go ahead and add the feet. And the feet are little J shapes or little U shapes that create the toes, and there are three of them together. One, two, and three. Now I'll add the big fan tail. And the way I'm going to do that is to draw some curving lines that look a lot like upside down letter U's. And I'll do that all the way around the peacock. So I have two of the feathers at the top and I'm going to draw a curved shape here, here, and here. Notice how they get slightly larger as they go towards the bottom of the peacock. We'll do the same thing on this side, a curved shape here, here, and one right down here, getting slightly larger as they get closer to the bottom. I'm just going over these curved lines rounding them out so that we have nice rounded shapes. And then we'll need to add the eyes of the feathers. And I'll do that as soon as I clean up a couple of these little lines here and there. So on top of each feather, I'm drawing a teardrop. These are those really pretty peacock feathers. And I'll just draw these on top of each curved feather that we drew before. I'm done with this side, so I'll go to the other side and do the same thing. Just some nice teardrop shapes all the way around the peacock. I need one more right here. And then what we need to do is to add some additional detail to the curved feathers. And those are just circles at the very top of each curved feather. These are those really pretty peacock feathers that you see, and eventually we'll color them in blue. And I'm doing the same thing in the teardrops. I'm adding a little circle inside of each teardrop. Just have two more to do, and then the feathers are all finished. 
At the top of the little feathers on the head, I've added a couple dots. And now I'll put the beak in, which is just a little curved shape or an upside down U. And then another curved shape that attaches to the bottom. And now I'm going to give this peacock some great big eyes. And these are kind of almond shaped eyes. I'll do the same thing on this side. And then when I have the outline of the eye done, I need to add some details inside of the eye. So I'm just going to take the bottom of the eye and I'm going to draw some curving lines in here, right like this for the iris of the pupil. And I'll draw two lines like that on each eye. And then I'll add some highlights. And the highlights will just be a couple circles in each eye. I'll put a large circle up here and a little tiny one down there. And then I'll do the same thing on this side. And then the next step will be to outline all of these these details and color in this peacock really pretty blues and greens. Thanks everyone for joining me today. If you liked this video, please click the like button and subscribe for notifications to all of my new videos every Monday through Friday. Thank you for watching today guys. Have a wonderful day. Happy drawing and see you next time.